Hey guys, welcome back to a new Dragon City video, and today there is a new island, so I'm going to be taking a look at it. It is the Egyptian maze thing, where you can get the new Isis Goddess Dragon. At least that's what I think it's called. Now let's go in and take a look, guys. It's going to show us the tutorial. I'm just going to skip it since I know what to do. And look, guys. We are in the new event. Okay, so the first dragon that is here is the Pharaoh Dragon. The next dragon is the Raw Dragon. Now let's take a look at this. This guy's path. Oh, um, we're looking at the dark blue path. Or dark purple, doesn't matter. And it has a really good path. And now the next dragon is the Isis Goddess dragon. We're looking at the white path. Which it has this chest on it. I don't know what that chest is. So, we're going to find out sooner or later. Two of them. Actually, then there's this Anubis dragon. I'm looking at the black path. Then we have the Scarab dragon. Taking a look at this lighter green path, I don't know what to call it. And now we're looking at the crocodile. Oops. Crocodile. Looking at this green path. And now we're going to look at this pyramid dragon. The purple path. The dark purple. And next is the Nile God. The light blue path. And then this arid dragon. The... Oops. The... Um, this brown path here. Not that bad of a path. Then the last one here is the Cleopatra Dragon. There is going to be two more. Um, which path? We're looking at the light pink one, or the hot pink one path. Um, there's going to be two more dragons that do come out, but they're limited time and they're not showing it to us. So, I guess that's what we get. Man, this path has some cool stuff on it. 
but the best path here is probably going to be this raw dragon but maybe isis goddess because i don't know what does isis goddess things do and i'll be right back okay we're back and the raw dragon has 17 steps each going to be really expensive is the total path is 28,900 coins. And of course, you might be wanting to do this in airplane mode. So you don't scam yourself, but... I am going to risk it for you guys. Because, you know, I'm okay with food, I guess. It's probably not, this dragon's probably not free to play to get. But the um the first the chest should be free to play. As long as I know. I don't even know, I'm pretty stupid. That's all we can do for now. So yeah, that's the new event. And in our storage, we just got a whole bunch of random stuff in this dragon. That legendary, in this legendary. Did I steal the hatch? So let's just do some battles. I'm guessing it's war only? And my high overlord, which I have not used yet, is here. I don't know what to feel about this. I'm gonna skip some of these. Yeah, let's do this one. I actually have not trained my high overlord. I haven't done anything to it, besides feed it to level 30. Tax Earl can be decent, I mean, yeah, it's the third strongest heroic. So I'm gonna use this guy. Pretty strong attacks. And we win the first battle with my heroic because it's super good. And guys, we got our first war chest. You want to see what we get? I do too. Cosmo dragon orbs and aminone dragon orbs and inky dragon orbs. A terrible chest. But I'll take it. We're not going to be fighting this guy. But we will be fighting this guy. Because some people forget to change their teams. They're not very smart. This is awesome because I just hatched this guy yesterday. And he's already helping. And I got this guy from the last event. I'm gonna be fighting this guy. Pretty easy team so far. With war only. I'm almost unstoppable. I do need to rank my vampire to A+. So yeah, that's what I'm going to try to be doing. A+, envious vampire, zero stars. 
because I didn't get the empowerment thing. Mm, we could... Yeah, let's do this one. High Eternal, High Fallen, and... This guy, Barbarian, because... That dragon's book's pretty good. Let's use Beehive. First move. Giant Claw going to do nothing. But then his High Fallen's going to do a little bit of damage. Oh, he decides to go Barbarian. Now, I don't have a Kratos... To destroy these war types. And we're just going to be switching between these guys. Hoping to win, you know? Now, this is not a good situation for us. Not a good situation for us at all. He going crit us. So I'm screwed no matter what I do. So I'm going to get this guy out first. Since I'm not going to really be using him. And then I should be able to kill him with this one shot. Boom. Yeah, that was easy. I hope that you guys are enjoying this episode. My last Dragon Save video was like 2 seconds over 15 minutes and I was angry at that. But this video, I'll try to end it as soon as I can. Hopefully. I am pretty stupid. One shot him. And then, I need to kill for this guy. We're just gonna win. Because that's everything I do. Besides those other videos where I lost, uh, we don't count those. Ooh, yes, finally, my high Virago got A plus ranking. And take a screenshot of that because I can. There we go. And we win. Now this is the team I was looking about. <laughs> high Earthen. High Scorchwig. Wing, not wig, and a freaking really strong Kratos. No, that's the kind of... <laughs> you gotta be joking me. Okay, this battle's gonna be easy. High Viragos are very useful here. But, I'm just... I already killed this little baby. Um... Boulder Dragon. It's already dead. Oh, you're gonna do that to me? Well, guess what? I'm gonna do that to you. Oh, God. Um, this isn't going out how I wanted to. Retreat, retreat, retreat. I'm hitting with that. And then he's dead. Because I win 99% of the time. And, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, um, press the like button. That'd be appreciated. And I hope you all have a good day. Subscribe if you want to. And bye.